Welcome back everybody, this is James and we are back with more Super Mario Brothers 3. We have made it to World 7 and this could possibly be my least favorite world in the game. Um, this is, I mean, one of them levels that I could live without doing. Um, <clears throat> four is a pain in the butt. Um, It's just a world that drives me nuts. Um, the last fortress on the level gives me trouble. This music note here drives me insane. With that small little lag that I mentioned at the beginning of the game, um, it can be a pain in the butt. Um, But hopefully we'll get through this rather easy. There's a couple of levels that I am going to P-Ring just for the fact that I do not like them at all. Um, I got four clouds that I am going to waste because I'm not going to skip any any levels. That's just not how I how I play and that's basically what the cloud does so I'm going to waste them and get some room for some power up when I get the card again um, I'll waste these clouds right now just to where I can I can have that space available. Right now I got enough room for about seven more power ups. Um, This is all, this level here is also the last level you can go to to get a uh, uh, the secret mushroom and get a P ring. Um, I'm not going to go after it because of the fact that. Ooh. 
<clears throat> and we got the card. We'll probably get another one um, depending on how my power-ups are looking or determine if I get the uh, second card. Um, I seriously doubt I am going to um, to use the um, I lost my train of thought here. Um, anyway, let me get this taken care of and I'll get back to what I was thinking because I don't remember. one more and I'll get that that um, plant thing ah crap that's not good guy's going to get me. He normally does. If he doesn't, that turtle does, but that's okay. I'll use a power up to go to five. I'll do four late, um, next. Four is a board that I just despise with a passion.
<laughs> that was almost dangerous. I probably shouldn't have did that, but that's okay. I think I know what this mushroom is going to be, but I'm going to hit it anyway. I think it's going to be something I ain't going to need. The uh, frog suit. I'm going to go ahead and use it. Buys more than any other board. This part here that I despise most, and normally that octopus thing, whatever its, it's, it's correct name is, and normally doesn't follow me that far. I don't know how I managed to get through that board on the first try, but I was able to. And now it's probably the strangest um, fortress in the entire game. When I first did this, I died probably 600 times on this one due to having a time out because I couldn't figure out what I was supposed to do. I didn't realize that you had to hit these boxes here. And if I wasn't recording, I do play this board probably six, seven, eight times till I got my 99 lives and then I'd be, be done. But I'm just going to go to, if I can get to 80, I'll just do 80 and then go beat the, the level.
looky there, we got another card. Um, we ain't gonna hit it right. Crap, I, I should have gotten a. Uh, I should have used the star there and didn't, but that's okay. Um, let's try this again. And let's go to World 6. And this is another board that just gets on my nerves sometimes. I mean, it's not that it's a hard level to, to beat. There's just a uh, annoying level at times. Ah, crap. No, I'm just a little bit too early there. <clears throat> and probably the two boys that took me the longest time to figure out how to beat here. Seven and eight. Shouldn't have gotten that. That's bad news. I'm going to have to use a, another power up there. We'll use a leaf. And I probably will lose my power-ups.
Well, I only lost one. Better than what I have been doing. So I can make it to go back and do the um, the car. Cause I'm using a Hammer Brother suit on on eight. This board ain't starting out the way I wouldn't have liked. And there's a reason why I want to use this. And y'all see why. Right here. Hmm. Well, so much for that. But I was able to to beat the board. We'll get this mushroom and then we'll go hit the the car for the last time in the game. And what do you know, we get another frog suit and we ain't got another water board on the game.
Ooh, I went to, to the wrong one. That's okay. I got plenty of power-ups now. Uh, get one more big man down there at that plant thing. So, I'm good. This one, this level here can also be a, a little bit annoying. Because, I mean, there's so much going on in this level. It just drives me up. Well, dang, come on. This is going to be the level I'm going to wind up P-ringing because because this board does not like me. And I was right there at the end too, but we're going to go ahead and P-ring this just to work. But just because I P-ring it doesn't necessarily make it easier because there is a part of this that does not suit me in a P-ring. Okay, right there is where I died. Right there, I always lose it. I ain't figured out how to get through that without losing it. But... Use one more star here. Yeah, crap, that wouldn't 
part of my plan. But that one was pretty easy. We got a big man. And y'all, to save time and effort, I'm going to P-ring this thing because it does get on my nerves too as we see the king being transformed into what will soon be known as Yoshi. An ugly looking Yoshi at that. Plus I have the P-ring so why not use them. And after all of me hitting the button for over a minute, we finally make it to the boss. And that makes... Well, I lost my P-ring, but I was able to beat the board. And... I have plenty of P-rings, I have plenty of other power-ups to use in World 8. A lot of them I will not use. King of Koopa kidnapped the princess while we were running around. She's in the castle. If we dare to try and rescue her, then we will. Um, I got one, two, three, four P rings. That should be enough. Um, but y'all, that's going to do it for this one. Once again, this has been James saying thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And come back and join me next time as we do World 8 and Super Mario Brothers 3. Y'all have a good one.